Now for a preview of what's new in theaters. Kylie Erica Marr from Made in Hollywood is here and I have some great movies to get to. <laughs> First up, Suicide Squad. Yes, so two words, squad goals. Really? <laughs> I mean, this cast is compiled of Will Smith, Margot Robbie, Jared Leto, Car Delevingne, Viola Davis, amongst many others. I mean, I interviewed 12 cast members of the film last weekend in New York City. It was totally epic. And they're all top notch. Mm -hmm. Yes, and they're so much fun, too. And so this film is a DC Comics film. It's brought to you by Warner Brothers, which brought us Man of Steel and this year Batman v Superman. I personally really liked the film. I know that the reviews aren't amazing, mm -hmm. but I can't wait to see it again. I think that the music is amazing, so the soundtrack is really great. Mm -hmm. And Margot Robbie, who plays Harley Quinn, is everything. But I do believe that she is the best part of every film that she does. And I think the reason why this film is so cool is because it's the anti-superhero film, so mm -hmm. it's different. These characters are weird and they're messed up and they're <laughs> the worst of the worst and it's fun to watch. So like I said, I did interview the entire cast in New York City. Here is a clip. Check it out. My Instagram feed is like a Suicide Squad party. <laughs> How did you guys get into that place? I think it started from the rehearsal space, you know. I think. Yeah. Oh, no. Sharing all of our... Sharing our deepest, darkest secrets. And I think David Ayer was smart about how he connected those guys. The potential was really only for disaster, getting this many individuals uh, in a room and having... It's like herding cats. Yeah. What am I, 12? How about you, hot stuff? Water. That's a good idea, honey. They got nothing on our squad, though, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. but, I mean, they look... That makeup is... It's pretty drastic. I know. Halloween costumes, definitely. Everyone yeah. this year. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so next movie, Don't Think Twice? Yes. So this film takes a hard look at hope, success, and failure through the eyes of the cast of an improv group who are struggling to make it big in the comedy world. In Made in Hollywood's Patrick Stinson interviewed the cast. How is this like a coming of age piece? I think it's about realizing, you know, the path that you think you want and the goal that you hope you want and then realizing maybe that isn't quite the thing that's going to make you the happiest. Yeah, well, we're all yeah. delayed adolescents. Exactly, yeah, right. As performers, so it, it takes us a bit longer. Everybody's seven years old until they're about 31. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, no, no. We all no, said we would wear the same outfit. Everybody agreed. I'm being a professor. You've got to go. Just kidding. <laughs> Patrick Stinson looks so much different, right? Just yeah. kidding. That was Julie Harkness Arnold. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Pretty next interesting. Up. We're going to talk about Amateur Night. Yes. So Jason Biggs and Jenny Mullen, they are a real life husband and wife duo. They brought this film together. So the film is a look at this guy who is an unexpected father, and his life totally changes when he takes this unexpected job driving prostitutes. It's a comedy. Oh. Uh -huh. <laughs> it's funny because he's this simple, mediocre guy, but he has this fish out of water experience. Ashley Tisdale also also stars in the film, and Julie Harkness Arnold did in fact sit down <laughs> with Jason Biggs and Jenny Mullen. I was watching this film and going, oh my gosh, these seem like my friends, mm -hmm. <laughs> believe it or not. They didn't seem like these stereotypic prostitutes. Do you think that was something they were going for? Because it is a true story and Joey, you know, ha did have, uh, it was more than one night. He ended up doing this for a little while, but I think people's perception of sex workers is a certain thing. It's limiting. What am I going to be driving? He says, girls. Uh, what are the benefits? Uh, you play your cards right. There could be all kinds of benefits, you know what I'm saying? The job is <laughs> I could not have kept a straight face during that interview. <laughs> Julie did great. I know, and they're really funny in real life, too, so I would have wanted to sit down for that in interview yeah. as well. You did a great job. <laughs> yeah. Thanks so much, Kylie. Thank you.